went out to Malibu the other day to film some of the destruction from the recent fires. And I couldn't help but think about how this scene reflected not just how so many must feel in the area, but how so many of us must feel with the current state of events in the country and the world at large. The brokenness, the barrenness, the destruction. And to me it begged the question, what is the catalyst to bring about change, to bring about healing, to bring about new growth and new life? As I began to think about this month's theme of being thoughtful, I thought of the phrase, what fills your thoughts? There is so much pain and destruction and suffering that goes on around us and we see on the TV every single day. But I do believe the value of our life can be improved by where we place our perspective. And could it be that it's only as we adopt this change in perspective and choose to focus the intention of our heart and mind on the good things in life, on the things that draw us together, to weep with those who weep and mourn with those who mourn and rejoice with those who rejoice, that not only will we begin to have a more healthy and happy life experience, but also become the catalyst for these things in our own personal community of family and friends. There is so much to live for. There is so much to hope for. I believe the greatest catalyst for change to overcome the darkness that we feel all around us is a firm foundation on the hope that we can overcome, a triumphant joy that we refuse to let go of, a determination that no matter what comes, we will not be shaken, we will stand firm, we will band together in unity, we will love in the face of hate, we will forgive in the face of malice, we will walk in joy and peace, despite fear and danger all around us, and despite everything that tries to deter and destroy our well-being, we will live a good and wonderful life more abundant.